NASA's Perseverance rover has landed safely on Mars. The rover, nicknamed Percy, traveled 300 million miles over six months to reach the red planet. Today, NASA released some color images of the terrain, including these shots of rocks on Mars. You guys, the rover comes equipped with a helicopter to see if it's possible to fly on another planet. But the main goal will be searching for signs of life. The rover will drill into the ancient lake it landed on and send back soil and rock samples to see if life ever existed there. Oh, Albert, what do you think they're going to find? Nothing. <laughs> There's nothing up there. How dare but it's you? It's cool that we can go. Sam, it's not, uh, there's nothing that could support life up there right now as we know it. I think it's cool that we're kind of expanding, going planet to planet. Probably not in our lifetime, but maybe there are uh, kind of sister planets to Earth that are similar to our environment that I do think we'll find, but we got to start with a baby step, and this is the first one, but this is just a rock, baby. That's not the point, Al. Yes, their atmosphere, they do have an atmosphere, but it's paper thin, so you're right, because it's mainly carbon so dioxide up there. We could not breathe. However, they're looking to see if there was ever life there, Al. Ever. Does it, I mean, Jeff, come on. You think this is cool. Yeah, I didn't know you were so into it. I'm always into space. Oh, yeah, I love it. I love this stuff. I, I think that's fascinating that we did it. We landed, we didn't explode, we got there, and we're gonna see if water is possible to find again so that we could return to Mars if we needed to. I believe we've landed there like seven times. Well, I'm glad we landed there again. <laughs> we're right, just clearly looking... Tori had no idea I that did. she should have been excited six times ago. <laughs> I have something cool to share about this Perseverance, nicknamed Percy. So there's a lot of Easter eggs on it, right? There's like some, oh, um, yeah, there's some Morse code on there. There's a bunch of different things. They have different students that submitted names on there, their actual papers, and then they even have a symbol um, of medical workers, frontline workers to honor them during this COVID pandemic. Isn't that cool? That's wonderful. Yeah. That's really wonderful. Oh my gosh, Al. I can't wait. Al's ascot is really I just, bothering I was me. I let that sit there because you guys, they, that's really not that exciting. I, I think hate it's your cool, ass. Yeah, your scribblings. ascot stinks. <laughs> we'll be right back. Yep.